Finally, the Brothertons have livestock again. Yes! Good job, baby girl. Woohoo! It is the first pretty day that we have had in the last. It's so pretty. I mean, two weeks. It's so probably. pretty. So, yes, it's gorgeous. So, we are canceling homeschool for no, this morning. No, we're not. We're Just, nature schooling. And we are going to get ready for the rabbits to come back. So, our house, so our property runs north and south this way, east and west this way. So, four rabbits. Rabbits do pretty good in the cold weather. They do not do well in the heat. So I'm gonna to try to get them as much shade as we can. We're probably gonna to have to build something eventually. I wanna build them like a little lean-to, three-sided little space. But for now, we're still gonna just do the hutch and we're gonna grow with that. And then we'll be able to tractor them at some point. We gotta, we gotta work on those things. First, what we need to do is be able to get the hutch, the amputated hutch. It's over there somewhere. And we need to put legs back on it and give it a space. Okay, so Callie, where are you? Callie abandoned me. Okay, so my thought is. What do you want in the grand scheme of living here? Is it this permaculture idea, work with the land? Yes, it is. And there's a big giant cedar right here yeah. that works with the land and gives me a fence post. Yeah. No, I'm good with that. That I'm down with taking out. There's the oak tree that... that gives us shade. No, that gives us acorns. So I'm cutting this off and that's a little bit of less acorns and it just makes it look a little less pretty. Have you just... seen these oak acorns? Oh yeah, David, there's acorns. Okay. Oh, yeah, yes. There's acorns everywhere. Okay. Um, so I think then the you're not pond for the... is, I mean, the, the cedar gives me fence posts and shade you it, just for year get, You want to clear some stuff and you want to open up that oak. Well, I would like to open up the oak. Okay, that makes so much more sense. I don't think you should try and put them here. I think you should put them here on the insides of all your braces. Like, don't try and build onto this. Such a bummer that I got rid of those legs. I know we had to. I don't think so. I think you've got it here. But I can't mount it to anything if I do it that way. Can't mount what? Uh, I, if I put it under here, can't really mount it. I maybe can use some of those brackets. You can take this off and then mount it from this two by four mm. and then put this back on now i could use a four by four post and notch it but that's a I lot thought of, of that too. that's a lot of time or i can just cut Why? or i can just cut these guys off again like just zzz, cut that off and then i have a flat space or you could just take this board off and put a whole new one on you have the boards don't you eh, maybe i returned a lot yesterday this thing definitely got beat up in the travels. It's gonna cost us more to fix it than. No, no, just just maybe new hinges, maybe. Yes. I... All right, so I'm gonna go and I'm gonna cut some 36 inch four by four posts and I'm gonna put them here on the outside of it. I think that's what I'm gonna do.
So then we're gonna lift and then try to set it. Let me try to don't turn it up. We're just gonna hold it for now. Electric levels, yes, that would be good. Okay. What were you laughing about? I'm laughing at your daddy. Get him on. Oh, come on. Why is it like that? But yeah. So, sorry, I stay one more. So I had to take a lot of this off because I had to replace the legs here. So now I'm just reshoring up all the hardware cloth, all the wire. So. Uh, it is done. We are back in the rabbit business. In two days, our rabbits come back and our rabbit hutch is ready. And Miss Jeannie from Cottontail Rabbitry is going to also bring us, I think, an extra hutch that she doesn't use anymore. We're extremely blessed. We're finally ready. I need to get their water and uh, food little trays a little J tray I don't know what those things are called the thing that you put their food in we are ready for our bunnies being back I am so excited finally the Brothertons have livestock again yes expect was Jeannie Cotton our rabbit breeder said hey um, if you have coyotes here because we were talking about wild dogs and predators she said what is gonna keep the coyotes from just eating through your hutch I was like, what are you talking about? They're in a hutch. 